I'm Nick Shell with Family Friendly Daddy Blog. I'm a very strong man. I can hold an entire 2017 Toyota Sienna with one hand. I'm very strong. All right, now that we got that figured out, let's figure out what to do about this. Well, first thing I need to, I want to open the door. I've got the keys in my pocket, so I'm just gonna, right kind of where that end is, I'm gonna press the button and then I just lift up like that. All right, so here in this position, you see the third row seats are folded up so that you can sit in them. But what if you wanted to fold them all the way down so that all this storage area, that the feet, the seats actually fold down into that, okay? Here's how you do it. Uh, look at this third button here. Well, let me zoom in. So if you're looking, you gotta look at the buttons, by the way, the buttons are up at the top. So if I immediately just wanna go down, see where it has the down arrow? So I'm just pressing that. I'm holding that down like that. Oop, I shouldn't let off to that. You have to hold it. And look what's happening right now. It's actually folding into the back area. So now we've got half of this available, half of it flat like that. So to do the other side, I'm simply gonna go to the right side this time. And there's the, the arrow pointing down. Just press that, hold it down. It, it throws you off at first because it folds up before it folds back. It threw me off the first time I did. I'm like, wait, no, you're going the wrong way. Okay, so look what I did. The way I did that, these buttons up here, the one that shows the down arrow on both sides, it's gonna go the wrong way at first, but then it comes back. Now, look at me now. We've got the van here, the Sienna, and it's completely flat right there as far as the, the back, the third row seat there. See that? Now, you say, that's great, Nick. Thanks for teaching me, but now I want, I actually wanna fold them all the way forward uh, instead of all the way back. We can do that. Let's go back to the buttons here. Let's take a look at the buttons up here. So let's let's try this one. Let's, uh, there, there's obviously just the opposite. It's on the same button panel. Just do the opposite. Let's see what happens when we hold that down. And if I stop holding it, it stops. So you have to, you have to hold that down. You have to commit to making it go up. Okay. So it's folding all the way back up into seating position. We're gonna do that again here. It's again on the same panel as the, one, the last one we did. But you have to hold it. You can't do like I just said. You have to actually hold it. And now it's gonna put the seats back in a normal position where you could have passengers in them again. There we go. So the last thing we're gonna do though, we wanna, we wanna fold them forward, right? So there's one button we haven't pressed yet. And it's the one that stands alone with one, only one option on it. So let's, let's try that button out, kind of like with uh, Charlie Bucket at the end of the Willy Wonka movie. They got that one last button on the elevator. Here it is, the last button by itself. Um, it, we're simply folding the seat forward. Instead of going back with the seat, we're going forward with the seat. That's all we're doing here. There you go. And let's try that again with the other side, with the smaller seat, just holding that button down and it's going down now. There you go. So, now in this event, depending on what you're wanting to haul back here, you've got all of this space, which is a lot. You could, I, it's like three of me could fit in there easily. Uh, that'd be weird. Why would I clone myself and put myself in the back of it? And then you've also got this area as well. So, I hope that helped. Less than four minutes, now you know how to completely fold up or down, forward or back, the seats in a 27. Toyota. Oh, can I press this button and close it? There we go. Let's try that. So now you know how to do that in less than four minutes. I'm Nick Shell, Family Friendly Daddy Blog. Google this and you'll find a blog version of it as well. Thanks for watching.